Hello guys and welcome to my channel where you can learn how to use Fusion 360 to program your whole Mac and Wiki CNC machine. All right, so let's get to it. As you can see here, I have uh, two different parts. This part, is, uh, uh, I'm gonna program this part here in Fusion 360, right? In other words, I'm gonna create the NPR files, right? For the whole Mac and Wiki CNC machine. So I have two different parts, all right? Uh, they both have rabbits. Uh, this one right here, which is um, a little wider than the other one, uh, has a groove right in the center. This part here is, um, is 120 and a half inches wide, oh, I'm sorry, long, and seven inches wide, all right? And uh, it's 18 millimeters thick, which is about 23, 30 seconds. That's the thickness of the plywood. And the rabbits are 25 millimeters wide. And I'm holding uh, half an inch here. So I'm not worried about how deep this is. All right. Okay, uh, this part here on the left is the same, same length as, as the one on the right, uh, but it's seven inches in width, all right. All right, so let's go to uh, manufacture. I'm gonna create a tool pass uh, from a template, all right, that I created um, a few days ago. I love using templates because they um, they speed up my uh, my programming, all right. So that's why I use templates a lot at work. So I'm gonna go to manufacturer. I'm gonna create a new setup, and I'm gonna select this model here. All right, under the setup box, all the way down to where it says model. Click here. It says nothing. And I'm gonna select this model here. All right. Uh, under stock tab, I'm not adding any material. All right, post process. Uh, I'm gonna name the program part underscore one, and I'm not gonna write a comment. Uh, I'll just leave it the way it is. You can you can type whatever you want. All right, so I'm gonna click OK. All right, um, I'm gonna name setup ten setup one. Okay, so I'm gonna create uh, the 2D pocket uh, from the template. All right, so I'm gonna right click, create from template. I'm gonna go all the way down to where it says select template. I have different um, templates here, different folders that I created. All right, 2D contour, got the pocket, got drilling, miter, I got a parallel, I got rabbits. So I'm gonna um, select the 2D pocket with 18 millimeter 46500 K down cut. All right, so I'm gonna select that. See under info, all right, gives you all the information, right? The name, the operations, how many operations you have. In this case, I have one. Okay, um, description is rabbits and roofs, all right? So I'm gonna select that. Okay, so I have no toolpath because I gotta select um, the geometry, right? That's gonna be machined. So I'll right click on it, edit. All right, I already have the 18 millimeter flat ML. All right, got the fee ray, got the spindle speed. Everything is set up here for me, all right? So under geometry, I'm gonna select this face here, all right? Under heights tab. I'm not changing anything here. Passes, um, I have it as 17 millimeters step over. All right, um, the compensation is gonna be left. Linking, I have um, the lead in and lead out, uh, uh, I have 16 millimeters. All right, the rim type is plunge. All right, so everything here looks good. I'm gonna click okay. Okay. There's a tool path. All right, so I'm gonna simulate it. Right click, simulate. Okay, start the simulation, right? Okay. Now the machine's gonna retract and it's gonna go back, all right? 
to where it started and it's going to machine the rest of the material all right all right so there it is I rotate model there's a rabbit it's nice and clean all right so let's uh let's program the second part so i'm gonna close this okay i'm not gonna create a new setup from scratch i'm just gonna um copy this one paste it so um i'm gonna right click and go to where it says duplicate right you can uh, you can use a shortcut control d if you want all right so i'll duplicate that all right so i'm gonna i'm gonna edit the setup i'm gonna need to set up uh setup two i'm gonna edit the setup all right and um where it says model i'm gonna select this model here so i'm gonna click on the x select this model okay all right that's the size of the stock okay i'm gonna click ok here uh i'll click on the arrow i'll drop it down I'll select the 2d pocket i'm gonna edit that i'm gonna select the uh, geometry uh, on this um uh, this panel so i'm gonna clear this pocket selection from the previous um setup all right so i'll click x i'll select this face here the one in the middle and the one in the back all right, so I'm gonna click OK. All right, and I got all the toolpath. So I'm gonna select this and right click. I'm just gonna simulate that. Okay, Let's click play. Okay, all right, so it looks good, all right. So next, I'm gonna post process, all right, set up one, set up two, okay. All right, so I'm gonna right click on set up one, post process, okay. All right, so part one, it's gonna go to that folder. So I'm gonna post it. Okay, there's a G code here. All right, so I'm gonna minimize this. I'm gonna post process setup two. Right click, post process. And uh, name the program part two, not part one. All right, so I'm gonna post it. Okay. Let's open up these programs in WoodWap. All right, so I'm gonna go to the folder. Okay, let's go for part one. Let's open it up. We walk, see how it looks like. Okay, there's part one. See, that's two macros. Right. Let's open up part two. Okay, and there's a programming we walk. All right. All right, guys. Uh, so um, I know it's been a while since uh. I made a video, uh, my computer was down, um, I had issues with my internet, um, so I apologize for that, but um, I got everything um, fixed, so I'm going to continue to uh, make more videos, all right, on how to use uh, Fusion 360 to program your whole Mac and Wiki CNC machine. I'm going to have, uh, I'm going to have videos of me making the part. All right, so um, stay tuned for that. Uh, all right, so um, yeah, but this is this is this is uh, this is a video, all right, for you guys. So uh, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.